Yeah, so that was that was a heartbreaker there. West Ball's putting his controller in his backpack like a sloth. <laughs> that was a heartbreaker there. Holy moly. So, Mr. West Balls, tell me about that ending. What'd you think of that? Like that that you guys had a a crazy back and forth set and then just like just like that with an air dodge off the off the side. Yeah. Um it was like really close matches, like the entire grand finals, and he was playing really good and then all of a sudden Bam. <laughs> well, yeah, well, it, it happens. Like, I mean, top level play, like, you want to play perfect. You want to, like, do perfect ledge dashes. Um, and just sometimes you don't get them. But, uh, I mean, I'm glad that you complimented how well Joy was playing. But I want to talk about how well you were playing. You looked like you were on point the entire night. Like, starting from your match or your set with Mike Hayes and how you just completely annihilated him, like yeah. those last two games. L loser, <laughs> loser of West Falls is uh, something different. And this, is, this has happened before, though. When was the last... Uh, SSS 32. You did something 31. very... 31? 31. Was, was that the one at Cal Poly? Yeah. That was a very similar run yeah, where yeah, you, yeah. You, t you brought it back. So what's what's going on, dude? What's your secret right now? Um, honestly, like, it's no secret. Like, there's a lot of tough competition, so I'm bound to lose to one of the top players. Yeah. But I feel like I'm, I'm better than them. So, like, once I'm in losers, like, mm. like... Something unfortunate happened to me against Mac MACD. Like, he down smashed me, and I just died randomly because I just DI'd really badly. Because, mm -hmm. so, like, stuff like that happens occasionally, and, like, you get, like, bad DIs or, like, bad, like, stocks. And um, in losers, like, you get another chance, and you get to, like, bring it back. So, like, I guess on top of that, playing match after match after match after match warms you up. And so by the time you're in grand finals, you're that's pretty prepared. That's a really good point there. And I'm glad that you brought up MACD because uh, – Tell us a little bit about what happened that second time that you met. Oh, that was a nail biter. Like, he was, like, playing really good. I took the first match solidly. and then With Captain Falcon. Yeah. I'm actually uh, a multi-main. You're a multi-main? Yeah. I've been, I've been a multi-main ever since I played. But, like, at the top level, I think Falco is, like, a little bit more consistent for me. Mm -hmm. So that's why I mean, like, that's why I kind of main him. Mm -hmm. So, like, whenever, like, I'm playing bad, I feel like Falco... He's not. He's a character where, like, even if you play a little bit like sloppy, it's fine just because like he has a lot of like other options he has. Yeah. But with Fox, it's like once he like messes up, like it's it's a whole rhythm with Fox. But with Falco, it's just like one mistake and you're you're out of it. Yeah, agreed. So. But that Captain Falcon though, tell us about that. All right. So, um, I think when I was like thinking about playing MACD, I was thinking about how can I kill him easy, mm -hmm. and Falcon's the character to do it. But um, after the first match, I started to slow down. I started, I started to, like, not his combo as hard. And then he started to punish pretty hard. And then by the time fourth game happened, he took uh, the next two. So by the time fourth game happened, I was just like, all right, I'm just going to go back to my main. And uh, I guess it worked out. Okay. And a lot of things worked out for you across a bunch of the different sets. You Against SFAT, someone that had just had a dominant performance at, uh, at Mayhem yesterday. Yeah. You said... I, I mean, I'm going to loosely quote you, but you told me earlier, you were saying, like, dude, SoCal needs to just step it up. And, like, I'm going to come in here and I'm just going to put in work and just yeah. take it, right? Like, I wasn't in the mood for Melee, like, honestly, because like, I've been playing so much. Yeah. So um, once I saw SFAT just destroy everyone one by one by one, I was like, like, I can't be dropping the ball. Like, it kind of <laughs> got me hyped. Like, I was like, all right, I got, like, I got another chance, like, at SSS. And so I kind of, like, hyped myself up once I realized, like, I had another chance. So, like, I've been pumped and, like, excited to play ever since yesterday. But, like, before the day, like, started yesterday, I wasn't in the mood for Melee. But once I saw, like, SFAT destroy everyone, I was like, I got, I got to start stepping it up, stepping it up for uh, SoCal. And I'm glad you did. You, you defended so SoCal's uh, SSS uh, championship so far. We, we're still holding that. Yeah. Um, tell SoCal's us. never won at SSS. <laughs> <laughs> Don't jinx it, dude. Um... Tell me, what, wh out of all the people that you played in this great loser's bracket run, I mean, who was the most difficult? Probably MACD, just because his character is good against Falco. Mm -hmm. I think Falco's weaker in that matchup. Okay. At the moment, or just, in, just all around? I just, th I just think in general, um, like, Peach wins the matchup if... Like, I'm not playing pixel perfect. If I'm making, like, a little spacing mistake or, like, miss, missing, like, an L cancel, like, mm -hmm. he can capitalize really hard on it. So I think you have to play better than you normally do to beat him mm -hmm. with Falco. So um, so I've been trying new characters and stuff. 
and then it just didn't work out, so I just went back to Falco. And um, I guess I was just playing really good. Um, I guess he wasn't playing as good as he was in winners. So, um, but MacD's no slouch. He's been improving so much. No, yeah, he's been improving at a like rapid rate. Okay, so tell us a little bit about um, about the future here. So you, we have some upcoming events. Yeah. Well, uh, tell us a couple of what those big events are. All right, so I'm going to DreamHack Winter. I'm going there too. And um, oh, you are. Yeah. Dude, that's gonna be hype. That's gonna be hype. And then um, I can't wait for that tournament just because like all the really good pl American players are going, and it's gonna be pow. And that's going to be a really big difference for Mewtwo King um, players. Like, uh, like it's going to be beneficial for some other players and other uh, people are not going to be benefited as much. So okay. it's going to be interesting to see. And um, other tournaments, I think I'm going to Eclipse in Norway. Mm -hmm. And then after that, um, what is it? Genesis 3. I registered for Genesis 3. You're missing a big one right before DreamHack and Eclipse. Oh, uh, Smash Summit, of course. Yeah. Of course. Of course, the Twitter drama. So have yeah. you have been following all of that stuff? Like, what are your thoughts on that? I've been following a little bit. Um, I wanted Over to win in the beginning, but then he got voted out, like, first round. So uh, I just stopped following after that, kind of. So um, I'm really excited to play at Smash Summit. I, w I wonder what it's going to be like, and it uh, should be fun. All right. Anyone you're looking forward to playing at Smash Summit? PP. PP? I want to play PP. Like, no like no one plays him so oh okay every like if i could just get to play him in friendlies like i would like to do that i've noticed and um this will be my last question but i've noticed that recently especially on twitter you've been expressing um a real like a real visceral love of the game like you you your tweets are about like yeah man i really want to play over i think we should like bring in over over triforce being the, the spanish chic main yeah it's just because we haven't seen overplay or yeah, like you really good you would you would tweet out things like that that you want to see particular matchups more so than you know like calling kind of following like the whole the drama you 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 are strictly focused on the game and it, it comes across it, yeah. you can definitely tell so i mean i you mentioned right now pp you want to play pp who are some other big names that you want to play uh, that you haven't played like at all, or you have you don't really play often. I kind of want to play Pew Pew again. Uh, mm. He's really good. Yeah. Um, just cause like I'm not really good. Like I thought I used to be really good against Marth, and then after playing like the top level like Marths, I'm like, okay, I need to get better at this matchup. Like I need to learn it. So I like to play him, um, just cause like I want to learn the matchup like, yeah. more. And then uh, the top ten are going. Um, I'm. I want to play Leffen again. Like, he's. I think like, you can take it. I honestly think he you can. is. Uh, like, he's a villain. So like, everyone really wants to beat him. So, uh, I want to beat him too. <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude, everyone wants to beat the villain. Everyone wants that that killing blow on the monster. Yeah. Okay. So tell us a little bit about where they can reach you. If you have fans out there, people that are following you, where, what, how can they get in contact and learn more about Westballs? All right. So uh, my Twitter is. Uh, Twitter or slash Tempo West Balls. Oh, or you could just right here. <laughs> <laughs> I was a fake attention. <laughs> or you could just, that's my Twitter handle. And then uh, my Twitch is twitch.tv slash West Balls. Awesome. And um, I actually just got my computer in yesterday. So I might be streaming later tonight or tomorrow, depending on if I get it running. Okay, cool. So yeah, follow, follow West Balls on Twitter. Um, Thanks for tuning in. This was Super Smash Sundays. You know, do a hashtag. Tell us what you thought about it. Tell us what you liked, what you didn't like. And, um, yeah, thank you all y'all for joining us tonight. Yeah. And thank you, Wes, awesome for winning. Dude, congrats. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. All right, peace Bye. out. Woo! <laughs> so good. The cloud games. Really good was an understatement. And, and they're still fighting on the cloud. <laughs> nice that was recovery. An option. Yeah, just side B hold it. Side B hold. Oh no! <laughs> no! <laughs>